Okay, magandang umaga mga kaibigan. Uh, just a while ago, I uh, made a short video uh, concerning some drills in Kali exercise that I do. Okay, and very common ang, ang sequences na tawag nila is Sinawali and that uh, I placed it in a reel in Facebook. Yung Sinawali po is uh, called Sinawali uh, because uh, if you know Sawali, okay, Sawali is a Tagalog term, a Filipino term for the 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 covering of the the skin of the bamboo okay they peel it off and then they weave it uh, one on top of the other okay in a mat so they weave it one on top of the other making it as a a mat like uh, mat okay uh, you know that's what they call a sawali so it's actually weaving of bamboo uh, skin making it a very uh, practical, cheap uh, replacement for a wall, okay? So, Sinawali is actually, Sinawali is actually, uh, as a term, if we translate it in, in English, as just like a weaving, okay? Just like weaving, it's like weaving. That's uh, how it uh, it's mean, uh, it uh, means, okay? So, Sinawali, if you happen to take a look and analyze the situation, there are two uh, sequences I told you before using hands, okay? So, we have the outward block, okay? And then parry and then strike the outward block, parry and strike, okay? Outward block, parry and strike, block, parry, strike, block, parry, strike, block, parry, strike, block, parry, strike. okay? So, if you make it uh, quickly, then that would constitute the Sinawali. Or you may use the inside block, a parry, strike, inside block, strike, inside block, parry, strike, block, parry, strike, block, parry, strike, okay? And you will note that, hold on. Okay, so if we analyze the moves, okay, this one is outside, this one is inside, then it replaces, okay? Then this becomes the outside and the inside replaces it okay it's in the same manner you will see that it's alternate being okay it's an alternate like weaving okay no matter how you do it whether you you have it outside or inside block it's actually alternating the position of the sticks and that's what they call sinawali so if you do the Sinawali quickly, it's actually like this. So that's Sinawali. Okay. Now there's another term they use in Kali. Uh, they call Abanico. Abanico is a Spanish word that has been used in the Filipino language as well, influence of the Spaniards. Abaniko means fan, okay? Now, abaniko means fan. Let me show you a fan. You will know that this is a fan if you see it, even if you don't uh, move it, okay? You will know that it's a fan. But when you have the, the stick, you don't know that it's, a, it's not a fan. But once we call it a fan, it's because of how you move the stick. Okay. So when they call abanico style, okay, it's like, just like Sinawali, the concept is similar. Abanico. Okay, this is abanico. You know that it's a fan when you see it. But then it becomes really a fan when you move it. So the motion, the motion is very characteristic. Okay. Now, <clears throat> a stick cannot be a fan, okay? But you will note the movement of the Sinawali stick becomes like a fan movement. And so when we say abanico is when you utilize the motion, how you use a fan and make it as a defensive or offensive move using a stick or a weapon. So abanico, abanico usually they, they characterize abanico they characterize abanico using single stick, you see, when they strike it this way.
that's the abanico style. That's the abanico uh, terminology used in Cali. Okay, so if you use two sticks, then it's basically that's how the abanico moves movement. And this is a very practical way of offensive and defensive moving. And of course, very good way to exercise your arm muscles. Okay, so it is alternate. The position is alternate. You change position. Okay, and if you further analyze, that is basically just like sinawali because you just do it simultaneously. Okay, this is sinawali when you do it. with a, a fraction of a second delay in the movement, okay? But actually, it is the same movement all the while. So you okay. can use this as a strike or a block, a strike, a block, a strike, strike, block. And it is a good way to exercise your arm muscles. This is Sinawali. This is Abani. Okay. So, I hope you can see the difference. And you, you can practice both, okay? Sinawali. Abaniko. And uh, there's a very much related move in Kali. They call witik. Uh, witik is a Cebuan word, a Visayan word for snap. It's like when you use a whip, not go for whip. You do a snap. You make a snap. That's one of the moves of abanico. That's one move, and then you return it back. That's actually a part of abanico, but. We think it's something like this. Or you do it in the opposite. That's we think. We think or snap. If you can see, these terminologies are very uh, similar when we use Kali, okay? They are very much related. This is Sinawali. Okay, this is abanico, and this is witik. Okay, okay. So, so much for today's tips in how we utilize kali in exercise. So, one of the things that you use in exercise is do the sinawali because it it energizes all your muscles, make it exaggerated. <laughs> This is Sinawali in exaggerated form. And this is Abaniko, exaggerated form. Okay? Okay, I hope you got the principles of Kali that can be useful as you do your morning exercises. Now, doing just the Sinawali for about 10 to 15 minutes when you start uh, studying the moves, do the Sinawali yourself, okay? Starting from slow movements, then increasing to stronger movements, okay? Then put some force to it. Then you can do the abanico, alternate, alternate, you see, abanico moves, if you have a single stick you do this.
okay you can move around you can kick it forward and that's a maniko and it gives you know a very good way of relaxing the muscles of the arm the hands the shoulders and if you do the moves complete with your with your entire body with your legs moving then you can have a very good complete exercise at the same time you get used to the moves of Kali and it might come in handy in terms of defense and offense if you use it as a martial arts again we are promoting Kali as a means of doing some exercise okay we are promoting Kali which is the martial arts of the Philippines as a means of a very uh, very versatile type of exercise okay so go ahead folks if you if you enjoyed this video and learn something from it uh, you may like share subscribe okay uh, when I reach uh, 50 subscriber by the way I can go on live and have an immediate uh, you know actual live interaction with you so thank you very much and uh, enjoy Bye-bye.